These are the 100 civics, history and government questions and answers for the United States naturalization test. According to USCIS, the civics test is an oral test and the applicants will be asked 10 questions of the 100 questions listed in this video. This video will help you focus on specific answers to make the information more easier to remember. In this video we will go through 20 random questions at a time. You can learn and memorize questions and answers using this video. If you want to memorize the questions and answers again then please go back and restart the video. What are two rights in the Declaration of Independence? Life. Liberty. Who is the Commander-in-Chief of the Military? The President. Name one U.S. Territory. Guam. What is the capital of the United States? Washington, D.C. The House of Representatives has how many voting members? 435. In what month do we vote for president? November Under our Constitution, some powers belong to the states. What is one power of the states? Providing schooling and education What is one responsibility that is only for United States citizens? Vote in a federal election. When do we celebrate Independence Day? July 4th. If both the President and the Vice President can no longer serve, who becomes President? The Speaker of the House. How many amendments does the Constitution have? 27 There were 13 original states. Name three. Delaware Maryland Virginia Under our Constitution, some powers belong to the federal government. What is one power of the federal government? To print money. Why does the flag have 13 stripes? Because there were 13 original colonies. What did Martin Luther King Jr. do? Fought for civil rights. Who is the father of our country? George Washington. What is the economic system in the United States? Capitalist economy. What is the political party of the president now? Democratic. What are two ways that Americans can participate in their democracy? Vote. Join a civic group. 
How many justices are on the Supreme Court? Nine. We elect a U.S. Senator for how many years? Six. We elect a U.S. Representative for how many years? Two. Why does the flag have 50 stars? Because there are 50 states. What is the name of the President of the United States now? Joseph Biden. Joe Biden. Before he was president, Eisenhower was a general. What war was he in? World War II. What did the Emancipation Proclamation do? Freed the slaves. Name one of the two longest rivers in the United States. Mississippi River. What does the President's Cabinet do? Advises the President. What ocean is on the east coast of the United States? Atlantic Ocean. We elect a President for how many years? Four. What does the Constitution do? Sets up the government. During the Cold War, what was the main concern of the United States? Communism. Name one war fought by the United States in the 1800s. War of 1812. Who is in charge of the executive branch? The President. Who vetoes bills? The President. Who was President during the Great Depression and World War II? Franklin Roosevelt. What is freedom of religion? You can practice any religion or not practice a religion. Name one American Indian tribe in the United States. Apache. How many U.S. Senators are there? One hundred. What is the name of the national anthem? The Star-Spangled Banner. Name the U.S. War between the North and the South. The Civil War. Who is the governor of your state now? Answers will vary. Visit the website to find the governor of your state. The idea of self-government is in the first three words of the Constitution. What are these words?
We the people. Where is the Statue of Liberty? New York Harbor. Who was president during World War I? Woodrow Wilson. Name one branch or part of the government. Congress. Name one war fought by the United States in the 1900s. Vietnam War. Who is one of your state's U.S. Senators now? Answers will vary. Visit the website to find your state's U.S. Senators. What is the name of the Vice President of the United States now? Kamala Harris. Who lived in America before the Europeans arrived? Native Americans. What do we call the first ten amendments to the Constitution? The Bill of Rights. What is the name of the Speaker of the House of Representatives now? Kevin McCarthy. Name one right only for United States citizens. Vote in a federal election. What is one right or freedom from the First Amendment? Speech. Who wrote the Declaration of Independence? Thomas Jefferson. Name your U.S. representative. Answers will vary. Visit the website to find your state's U.S. representative. What territory did the United States buy from France in 1803? The Louisiana Territory. What major event happened on September 11, 2001, in the United States? Terrorists attacked the United States. What are two cabinet level positions? Secretary of Defense, Secretary of Homeland Security. What are two rights of everyone living in the United States? Freedom of speech, freedom of religion. What is the supreme law of the land? The Constitution. What was one important thing that Abraham Lincoln did? Freed the slaves, Emancipation Proclamation. Why do some states have more representatives than other states? Because of the state's population. Who makes federal laws? Congress. What is an amendment? A change to the Constitution. 
What does the judicial branch do? Reviews laws. Explains laws. What ocean is on the west coast of the United States? Pacific Ocean. Name one problem that led to the Civil War. Slavery. How old do citizens have to be to vote for president? 18 and older. What is one reason colonists came to America? Economic opportunity. What movement tried to end racial discrimination? Civil rights movement. When must all men register for the selective service? At age 18. What did the Declaration of Independence do? Declared our independence from Great Britain. Name one state that borders Canada. North Dakota. What are the two parts of the U.S. Congress? The Senate and House of Representatives. If the president can no longer serve, who becomes president? The vice president. Why did the colonists fight the British? Because of high taxes, taxation without representation. Name one state that borders Mexico. Texas. The Federalist Papers supported the passage of the U.S. Constitution. Name one of the writers. James Madison. What is the rule of law? Everyone must follow the law. What stops one branch of government from becoming too powerful? Checks and balances. Who is the Chief Justice of the United States now? John Roberts. What is one promise you make when you become a United States citizen? Defend the Constitution and laws of the United States. There are four amendments to the Constitution about who can vote. Describe one of them. Citizens 18, 18 and older can vote. Name two national U.S. holidays. President's Day. Independence Day. What is the capital of your state? Answers will vary. Who does a U.S. Senator represent? All people of the state. What happened at the Constitutional Convention?
The Constitution was written. Who signs bills to become laws? The President. What do we show loyalty to when we say the Pledge of Allegiance? The United States. What group of people was taken to America and sold as slaves? People from Africa. What is one thing Benjamin Franklin is famous for? Oldest member of the Constitutional Convention. What did Susan B. Anthony do? Fought for women's rights. Who was the first president? George Washington. When was the Constitution written? 1787. What is the highest court in the United States? The Supreme Court. What are the two major political parties in the United States? Democratic and Republican. When was the Declaration of Independence adopted? 1776. When is the last day you can send in federal income tax forms? April 15th. Who did the United States fight in World War II? Japan, Germany, and Italy.